President Donald Trump has ordered $200 billion in new tariffs on China. Uh, that's just days after imposing more than $50 billion in tariffs on Chinese imports. China is striking back. It means Minnesota farmers in counties that voted for Trump could be hardest hit. Here's Pat Kessler's reality check. China's retaliation on U.S. products is boomeranging back on Minnesota farmers who voted for President Trump. New data by Moody's Analytics shows vast areas of the Great Plains are most affected. This Wall Street Journal map shows the worst economic damage right down the middle of the country in the reddest of red Trump counties, barely touching blue Hillary Clinton counties on the east and west coast. But we came this close to winning the state of Minnesota. President Trump came close to winning Minnesota with major support from farm country, capturing 75 of 87 Minnesota counties. Now most of those counties will suffer from retaliation tariffs, especially from China. How bad will it be? Minnesota exports will get slammed, especially swine byproducts that are used in everything from paint to heart valves, also whey, soybeans, animal byproducts, chicken, and pork. President Trump appears concerned about soybean prices, tweeting that he's fighting for farmers and a better future. But Moody's calculates the damage could be significant. The gross domestic product hit hard in many Minnesota counties that voted Trump. The top five counties hurt most. Nearly 35 percent of Todd County's economy will be hit. Then Watonwan, Nobles, Marshall, and Norman County. That's reality check.